Now I like a little bit of tech. When a tech company gets in touch with me, I look at the products and I think, is this something that I can use? Or just as importantly, is it something that you out there, our viewers, could possibly be interested in? So I've been sent this from Cable Time. It's a 10 in 1, 8K USB C hub, and you can add on dual. 4K up to 60 gigahertz monitors with this. And you're probably wondering what the heck is it? So first of all, that's the box it comes in. Um, and it's got all the illustrations and guides and things like that in here. Obviously I've got a laptop. Also in the box is a little thank you card and a little warranty card and some instructions, which are, if you're into, if you're into tech, you'll, you'll, you'll you'll understand what this is. It also comes in its own little carrying pouch, it's, its own little pouch like this. And if you notice at the minute it's quite high and the reason being is this is what we are going to be looking at during this little bit of a review video. You see this here. So it's a brushed aluminium body so it's not cheap plastic and it's got a braided USB cable on it and the <laughs> simple thing with this is the cable if you're not got it in use and you want to transport it can be stored into here you can have the little carry handle and if you wanted to carry it into the bag without the long cable obviously it goes like this so what we've got is we've got a USB-C and we've got a number of ports on here so as you can see, um, you've got a port for an SD card, a micro SD card, the TF card. Um, you've got type C out, type A's. You've got a fast USB type A out. And here, if you look carefully, you've got a HDMI and a D port connector. So this will enable you to connect your PC to, to, to an additional monitor or up to two monitors. I'm not going to do that in this demonstration. I'm just going to just show you it working. And if your laptop, like this one here, does not have an Ethernet cable on it and you want to hardwire your laptop um, in, you have got an Ethernet. So what we can do if we wanted, there's, there's lots of ways, you can use this independently but I'm actually just going to power this a power cable so I've got a, a brick for the laptop and going to plug it into here and straight away, can you, is the camera going to, is the camera going to pick this, the, the, will the autofocus pick, pick this up? The, um, the display, there we go, we're getting a high, high! This can now basically be plugged into the laptop. Sorry, I'm just going to just connect myself into the machine. And obviously, everything is coming alive, isn't it? Um, I'm just, <laughs> I'm doing the review in, in limited space, as, as you obviously can tell. So you possibly can't see, but down here now, the, so the power source is now powering the laptop. Um, and then we can now start to um, attach our different devices. So I mentioned before, so this laptop has not got a card reader. So if I'm using a card, I have to have a, an adapter. And then I have a SD to micro SD adapter. And what you will notice is these can be quite simply plugged in. And I don't know whether the camera is going to be able to pick this up or not, but this is now showing that there is two devices connected to here. So I've got the power and the SD card. And if I take that out, I don't know what that is. Possibly, you possibly can't see, but it is displaying that there's one device. And then I can take the micro SD card plug in and it's now showing that it's reading that card 
This is empty at the moment, so I'm not too sure if this will pick up. Yep, it has done. So that is now showing there are three devices connected to this. Power in, SD card and the micro SD. It's got um, a hundred, sorry, a thousand megabits Ethernet connector. So if I now had um, an Ethernet connection I want to make on there, or a LAN connection, local access network, um, say direct from a router, you could plug this in, which would then feed into the laptop. And like I explained before, you can now attach different monitors or different screens by the HDMI function from this little device if you did want to do that uh, and as I say it's, it has got this brushed aluminium body on it and obviously you can if you wanted to start to plug in some devices if I wanted to plug this into here just as an example um, so that is charging up some batteries and you can also, this is a USB type, is, that, is it, it's also focuses playing up, <laughs> into here and in turn, oh it's here isn't it, or you can now plug that into here and then we have now got um, other things charging up so because I'm constantly creating video content um, these are microphones so that is nice and easy to have plugged in permanently these are batteries for a drone that I use so that can be nicely plugged in as I say I've got the SD card reader and the micro SD card reader and then if I also wanted to, I could say plug the camera into this and it will connect straight to the computer instantly, basically. Um, very, very, very simple. So as I say, it is the cable time. It is a 10-in-1 device. There's 10 devices can actually go into here on, on each time. And as I say, you have got this little cool display and you can feed the power in, which then it becomes like the hub for your computer so if your laptop it doesn't necessarily even need to be a laptop even if you're on just a tr traditional desktop pc uh, this can be used and it can be used on a mac or a pc as well um, and as i say you can you can expand your, your monitors if you so wanted to and as i say you've got that thousand megabits ethernet um, speed on it and it, it is so it is so cute and tidy. So let me just pull it out of here, just one minute, to bring this up to you into a little bit more detail. And all being well, all being well, you're gonna be able to see what this looks like. And again, this, this such a simple idea. So instead of the cable just flapping if you're not in use, it can go in just like that and that can be a little, little, little handle for it. It is compact. And it just does exactly what it's meant to do. And let's see if I can get the camera to... Come on, camera, you're going to have a bit of an autofocus book. So, there we are. You can see it all around. It's the Ethernet port. And coming on to the sides here. so it's good looking it's super lightweight nice and compact and it will allow you to um, add more functions to your machine if you so wished and as ever I am going to put some links down there in the description below if you want more information on where to buy this from but yeah nice quick and simple to use